a simple little trick I found in VideoPad here. Well, it's not, not anything special. It's just special to me because I figured it out. I thought I'd share it because I have a friend who is just learning VideoPad. I'm going to go full screen. And I could even, you know, I can undock these panels and throw them over here to the other screen. Um, and I can do it. Maybe someday I'll do a whole review of the whole thing. But just for the sake of this video, I'm going to blow up this part of the screen real high. And what I found I could do, this is just a simple way to cut a video. I, I had the end of a video all made, I put this last piece on to a video, and it's over on sequence number four here, this whole video. And I decided, you know, I really wanted to put another piece to this, and it really should be its own video and not really be part of this video anymore. But I like that I put a annotation on it already, and already had my end all figured out, you know, and so I didn't really want to scuttle all that work just to eliminate this clip, you know, put the ending back on. So I highlighted all this stuff, and just like any time when you're highlighting with, you know, using the, uh, the right mouse button, highlight the first one, and then press control and start highlighting the other elements you want included, which was this element here, and uh, this one, this one, this one. So I included everything I wanted for that piece that I want to shear off of this video, and then all I had to do was hit, I hit group selected clips. I don't know if I even needed to do that or not, once they were all highlighted. I probably didn't even need to do that. That's probably for some other thing. Well, there's probably another way to do this, actually. But what I just did is hit copy, and then I went over to uh, sequence 5, which was empty at that point, and then I just pasted, and voila! So that's all there is to splitting a video in VideoPad.